in one of Shane's blogs, he had seven questions that he answered, the little tag, one of those tag videos, so I thought I would do it. So the first question is, best and worst year of school. My best year was probably this year, eighth grade, because, stop scratching <laughs> my dog. See, he's attracted me when I make videos. It's true. Um... Probably this year because I've been doing a lot better in school. I'm actually not failing for <laughs> once. And the worst was probably sixth grade or seventh because I was like, I was bullied really bad by a lot of people. And it still happens, but this year has gotten a lot better. Um, number two, haircut you wish you could pull off. Oh, wow. Um, it's kind of a tie between two. Um, if anybody has seen Hylita Bear, her channel, I'll link it below. I like her new haircut. It's really pretty. I wish I could do that. Or Amber is dead. I like her old haircut. The really seen swoopy hair. <laughs> I don't like that. I don't know how to describe it, but I'll put their channel below so you can see. Uh, number three. If you could live as a character in any movie, who would it be? I'd be Alice from Twilight. Um, only because she can see the future. And she's really cool. I like her. Uh, four. Favorite YouTuber. That is a tie between probably three people. Um, I like Chili the Ninja, because he's really cute and funny. I, I just laugh my ass off when I watch his videos. Uh, Shane Dawson. He's hilarious, too. And probably Brian Starr's interviews, because I just love when he does Black Bill Brides and asking out Alexandria. Um, I saw Sleeping with Sirens interview last night. It was like freaking amazing. It was great. Um, five. Make up a word. What does it mean? I made up a word a couple months ago, and I'm not gonna tell you guys what it means. It's bash. I called everybody when I was angry a bash. I'm gonna use it in sentence. I can't believe you're acting like that. You are being such a bash. It is a it each letter stands for something. And I'm not going to say it, but really it would offend people bec only because they didn't know what it meant. That, w that was hilarious, and it always made me feel so much better. Six. Amusement par park or lay in bed? All right. I love amusement parks. I love going on all the rides. I like the food. I love going to the concerts. I don't like walking around all day. I would love amusement parks. If I could just kind of, like, get a ride all around the park to each ride, then I could do it. But laying in bed, I I love laying in bed. I'll do that on the weekends. I'll just stay on my laptop all day and talk to people. So, I don't know. I'd have to stay laying in bed because I can't get a ride around a musical park. Seven. Weirdest thing you've been asked by a parent. Oh, crap. The weirdest thing I ever got asked by my mother. I have one for each my mother and my father. Uh, a couple of years ago, I was at a jewelry, sh a jewelry show with my mother, and we were sitting there in our tent in, when we were after we set up all our jewelry, and she asked me, do you know what a lesbian is? That had to be the weird, awkwardest question my mom has ever asked me in my life, because a lesbian couple walked into our tent, and she, after they left, she asked me, do you know what a lesbian is? Do you want me to explain it to you? I'm like, no, I know, don't. Don't go there. I don't want to know. <sighs> Weirdest thing my dad ever asked me. Now, this is awkward because me and my dad don't have those awkward conversations. He says, leave it to your mother. That's her job. The weirdest thing he asked me had to be the other night. Why do you want to be such a whore and have a sleepover with boys? I don't know where he got it. Don't know why he thinks I would say that or want to. But he actually asked me, why do you want to be a hoe and sleep with boys? I'm like, what? what? What were you talking to mom about now? What was she telling you? What? What's going on here? But yeah, it was a really awkward moment, and I just kind of left the kitchen. Never, never finished the conversation. We ate our chicken fingers in silence. <laughs> but um, yeah, that's a bit for my seven questions. Um, yes. Now I'll put all the channels I mentioned below, and you can go check them out. Um. So, yeah, that's about it. Uh, happy Valentine's Day, everybody. I'll make another video a little later about Valentine's Day. So, yep.
Love you guys. Thanks for watching.